So next up, this is quick, but it's big. Cardano reaches a major decentralized milestone. And what it all comes down to is this. Over 50% of all blocks in the Cardano network are now being validated by public stake pools, according to announcements shared by IOHK. So before this, when they launched Shelly back in July, it was all pretty much done by IOHK. And then when they got the stake pools going, and it actually was a lot faster than what they thought it was going to be. And now, uh, as of today, they're around 50%. And then as, as of Friday, they state, it's going to be stake pools will be 51%. IOHK or IOG, whatever you want to call it, will only be mining 49% of the block. So very interesting. And this is one of those criteria or criticisms, I should say, that people have been talking about Cardano. It's not decentralized, not decentralized, it's not really great. Takes too long, so on and so forth. But uh, here we are. We have proof that, uh, yeah, doing pretty good. And lastly, IOHK's technology manager, Kevin Hammond, claimed this. The end goal is to have all blocks produced by stake pools, all of them, which will make governance completely decentralized. And, it, and he says, IOG, or Input Output Global, instead of IOHK, Input Output Hong Kong, will continue to run its own stake pools that will produce blocks in line with the stake they attract, just like any other pools. But... These will no longer have any special role in maintaining the Cardano network. It will also, of course, delegate a substantial amount of stake of its stake to community pools. Simultaneously, the voting mechanism will be enabled and it will no longer be possible to increase and re-centralize Cardano. And then it talks about there's actually, uh, they wanted around 1,000. They thought it'd be great and they already have 1,208 stake pools. So this is a great news if you are a Cardano on top of the news that we talked about last week where the Gogan timeline is going to be completed in four months by February 2021, which will create uh, Cardano into a smart contracts platform on also on top of the fact that you can do an ERC20 converter. So you can take, if, if something's built on Ethereum, you can very easily just take it, take that ERC20 and just convert it over to the Cardano network. And, if, and we saw the actual example. It took them like 10 seconds. It was awesome. So this could be a game changer we will see anyhow that is it for today so thanks for sticking with me i really appreciate it also before we take off i want to give a random shout outs to people who have signed up for digital asset news really appreciate it and these are the new ones so uh raymond tanal thanks eric mitko crow 24 7 franz braun fry alvi ignacio frank p dub that's a good one dad beam <laughs> mark reese bill ennis and Iran Rodriguez. So everybody, I appreciate uh, you signing up. Uh, I'm going to reward everybody very soon, as soon as I'm able to verbally uh, confirm that I can launch uh, the actual website. It'll be free. That's gonna be a lot of great information. It'll be very easy. All will have video and uh, just a very easy place to learn everything you really wanna know instead of having to hunt for it all through YouTube or even my videos. So uh, let everybody know, hopefully this week, if I can get uh, everything moving. But that is it. So thanks for uh, sticking with me, I appreciate it. And uh, I will see you on the next one.